the next one is uh, basic array operations using for and for each uh, loops so if you have an array of f of i something like this it is equivalent to 0 4 0 uh, till 4 this thing you already know like if you want to use for each on this thing you will directly mention for each of the value f of let's say i or this i ranges from maybe 0 to 4 in this case is equivalent to this particular thing is equivalent to like int i equal to 0 i less than or equal to 4 i plus plus so the i value is running from 0 till 4 so if you have an array like reverse 6 uh, 6 uh, till 2 then the statement would be for each reverse of i this is equivalent to 6 going till uh, 2 this is from like from last to uh, beginning if you want to go from last to beginning in this in such cases you will be using something like this now let's see how to use for loop and for each loop on arrays Here I am to, uh, taking two uh, variables, uh, source and destinations uh, kind of thing and let me try to initialize source, uh, source array. You can use this. Uh, dollar size to determine the size of uh, source let's now uh, uh, initialize the destination with uh, for each let me give it a value of source of source into two times finally we will display the values Let's try to run this and see what the values this thing gets. So you can see a uh, source array is having values, certain values and destination is uh, two times the values of the source. So this way we can use these uh, for loop and the for each loop.